throughout my entire life as a fly tire, I've always been hell bent on my flies looking as different as possible from the guy in front of me. That's always been, it, it, it drives a lot of my thinking. So, and so with that, I've done things like the composite loop, blending dubbings. I, I can't, I can't take dubbing out of a package and just use it. I have to blend it and create some other thing. And then that other thing allows me to be confident about it being different. You know, and that silhouette of that is that back silhouette, that profile, it's, it's hard to deny. And the movement, you know, it's got such a great movement. A really good animation falling, good animation swimming, good animation diving, because it's keeled in the front. The fly gets eaten, there's no doubt about that. And what's really sad though is, is that <clears throat> in all the light we have in this space right here, that if you took this out in the sunlight, this is where this would shine. As soon as you add it to the river, that's when all of the effect and all the detail and the color in the body and the turkey all comes out and the fly just goes pow. Comes to life, like you said, it looks like a natural part of the food chain. Oh, okay. Do you need a little moisture, Mr. Intruder? Just add water. I'm sorry. Were you getting thirsty? <laughs> 